Assistance League of Klamath Basin is an organization that uh, was started here about 35 years ago, and um, it's uh, a group of people, primarily women, but we also have one male member as of this year, and others will be following, I'm sure. It's a social but mainly philanthropic organization that um, that oversees uh, and works on projects in the community, working with primarily families, families in need, families in crisis. Operation School Bell is one of our major projects that provides clothing and shoes and hygiene kits for children in our school system here in Klamath Falls and Klamath County, uh, grades K through 12. And it, the kids are referred into our program who are recipients of these items uh, by teachers, guidance counselors, principals, school nurses, concerned professionals within the school system. And we do fundraising throughout the year to, um, to have the monies to offer these certificates to the children. And what we do is we offer the kids a gift certificate for $115, um, generously provided uh, by our donors throughout the year. And with the cooperation of Fred Meyer, um, uh, this evening is an example of the four nights that are held every September where families and kids come and actually do their shopping, pick out school clothes and shoes for the upcoming school year. Funding is collected um, a number of ways, primarily um, through the efforts of our volunteers within Assistance League of Klamath Basin. Uh, we work at a store called Findables, which is a secondhand um, furniture and household decor uh, shop on East Main Street in Klamath Falls. And um, all of the volunteer hours that are put into that uh, to work it uh, is done by our, our group. And then all the money that's raised goes 100% into the program. Unless people can sign their furniture, then they take a certain percentage back home. But the rest of it goes to the program. The largest um, funding source is probably our grants that we receive throughout the year. This has been a great year. We've got a wonderful grant writer within our program, and we've received oh probably oh, maybe thirty thousand dollars roughly in grants. Uh, and then we've got another uh, generous donor that has come through for us and has for about the last five or six years that is um, more than that even every year and um, they remain anonymous and uh, then also we have a fundraiser in December usually the first week in December it's called the Jubilee and it's a very um, gala event usually held at the Running Y. Our organization is uh, it is a membership in Assistance League but uh, the criteria for membership is just wanting to um, make new friendships in the community with other, uh, I guess, volunteers with the same passion to help kids and uh, want to do something positive for the community and for the families here. So uh, I would just invite anybody who would like to be uh, a member to call Findables um, or visit Findables and uh, or get on our website and uh, we'd welcome them to join us.